G5 Jeff TV. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the share button as you come on in. Big shout out to all the sponsors of the channel. All the information is in the description box. And follow your boy on Instagram and Twitter at Box with G5 Jeff TV. Now, Devin Haney, Adrian Broner, been going back and forth, social media, talking about a fight. Adrian Broner trying to get $20 million for Devin Haney. Like, <laughs> Like, can't knock him for trying to get the most. But, you know, that's basically pricing himself out. Uh, Eddie Hearn basically invited Adrian Broner to have a real conversation about the fight. Now, Eddie Hearn said that he would like the fight to be at a catch weight of 143 pounds. Now, we all know Broner hasn't been in the ring in a while. We all know Broner doesn't watch his weight in between fights. And the thing with Broner is... He's going to have a major weight cut, whether it's at 143, 140, or 147. But when it comes down to it, I think Devin Haney, if he had a a proposition in front of him where he had to go to 147 to see Broner, he should do it. He should do it. I know he's fighting at 135 right now. I know he's coming off a of shoulder surgery and he's recovering, but... Not a lot of fighters get a chance to build their name off of someone as popular as an Adrian Broner at the end of the day. So he needs to definitely look at going to 147 if that's what he has to do to get the fight with Adrian Broner. And basically, when it comes down to it, Adrian Broner in training and sparring is a whole different fighter than he is in an actual fight so what i'm gonna do right now is actually show y'all how he gets down in sparring Now, that was an example of Adrian Broner at the Floyd Mayweather gym in the doghouse in complete beast mode. He's confident that he's better than the other guy. He know the other guy not going to throw nothing back. He just going in there and just, quote unquote, letting his hands go. The reason why I'm saying Devin Haney should go up to 147 to go see Adrian Broner is because what you just seen right there in the doghouse, Adrian Broner don't do that in a real fight. He don't do that in a real fight. A lot of times he keeps his hands in his pocket. And what's the knock on Adrian Broner? Adrian Broner don't let his hands go. And the thing that's more frustrating is you see sparring sessions like this where he is letting his hands go and he's capable of letting his hands go. It's just when the lights is bright and everybody's watching, a lot of times he keeps his hands in his pocket. He plays defense the majority of the fight. So the risk is worth it for Devin Haney to go to 147 to see Adrian Broner. I think Devin Haney would outbox him. I think Devin Haney would outwork him. And that's the blueprint on Adrian Broner on how to beat Adrian Broner. A lot of times you just have to outwork him. You don't even have to outland him. Just outwork him and you're going to beat him. You know what I'm saying? Maidana did it. Uh, Sean Porter did it. Mikey Garcia did it. Like, the blueprint is there, but Devin Haney has a chance to become a real star by beating Adrian Broner in terms of popularity. And right now, Devin Haney, it looks like he's not going to get a Lomachenko fight. He's not going to get a Tiafimo Lopez fight. And then... I don't know what he would be looking at at 140. So if they, if Eddie Hearn was to get Adrian Broner at 147, hell yeah, Devin Haney should take that. Devin Haney should definitely take that because that, that fight would do crazy numbers on the zone. And bottom line is Broner ain't got nothing else popping right now. 
he has nothing else popping right now. Like not that long ago, he was just on social media asking people for cash apps because he was struggling. And then a couple of days later, he was like, oh, I'm in Miami. I'm about to throw 100000 up. Like, Broner ain't got nothing else going on right now. So forget the catch weight. They need to make that fight at 147. And if the real Broner shows up, then Devin Haney going to have problems. But if past experience holds true, then Adrian Broner going to keep his hands in his pocket. And Devin Haney would become a bigger star than what he is right now. If he takes that fight at 147, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. G5 Jeff TV, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Please share this video, support your boy, support good content at all times. I appreciate y'all. Peace.